award of the day is the Pioneer Award. Pioneers are known for their adventurous spirit, for seeking opportunity and exploring the unknown. The Pioneer Award recognizes an individual with the courage and determination to create a new path in the addiction and recovery space. This year's Pioneer Award winner honors an individual who played an absolutely critical role in shaping the very beginnings and the foundation of Recovery Reinvented, crafting it into an experience that offers hope and possibility to the people seeking a pathway to recovery. It also supports those people that are already on their established journey and it brings together family members, community stakeholders, and all those that are interested in part of making a difference. The Pioneer Award embodies an entrepreneurial spirit, the courage to dare greatly, <laughs> an expert collaborator who consistently brought people together oops, to, um, you know, uh, <laughs> brought people together to focus on the mission of Recovery Reinvented, to eliminate the stigma and the shame of addiction and empower communities to embrace recovery. I know why the First Lady is getting emotional because this individual played a key role in helping guide the whole creation, the foundation of what we're doing. She was the first managing director of, the, of Recovery Reinvented. She helped organize the first and through the first five conferences. That's right. Uh, and she's back here with us today. You've and seen her she, on. She left her job at Microsoft to come and do this Recovery Reinvented thing. She. You know, and that was like, she took a huge leap, you have to say. You know, Microsoft, super stable, probably has equity ownership, you know, I don't know. <laughs> but to come and do this work with us, Which this was brand an idea, new venture. Which was an idea and a startup with no employees, That's right. no program, no plan. So a true pioneer. But she's, of course, a... Uh, uh, been an incredible supporter of the First Lady. The two of them are dear friends. She's a leader. She's a connector. Please help bring on stage with us right now the 2022 Recovery Reinvented Pioneer Award winner, none other than last year's MC, Jenny, Jenny Olson. Olson. <laughs> And you go see a beautiful box there. I'll hold that while you want to talk. But this yeah. is the, the look at here, that. Here, here has Lori Kempenek made these, and of course, uh, each one of these made with love. It's, yeah. It has treasure. your name on it, so you can't you can't regift it. <laughs> <laughs> I would never. Yeah. So to be clear, you said we were going to end on time, but now I have the microphone, and I no longer work for you. And like I'm not backstage <laughs> tracking spreadsheets and time anyway. Um, this is incredible. This is incredible. Um, what Doug and Catherine said about I left Microsoft to come try this recovery reinvented thing. Um, scariest thing I've done in life thus far. And um, but it was a moment in time. There's a crisis in the country. We have these leaders here. It was an opportunity. And it will be by far the coolest thing I have ever been a part of. But what I would like the audience to know is that I came into this, I knew nothing about addiction and recovery. I did not have a personal story like so many of the people you have here up here. And I did not have a degree or expertise in the field, which is now you're probably questioning why you hired me. But the, <laughs> the it was coming into this community, um, you gave me an incredible gift because you taught me, you included me, you opened the doors, had all of these conversations. Um, and I was really a couple months in having a crisis of confidence, like how can I, con how can I contribute when I don't have those tools? Um, but I want to let all of you know that when you share those stories, you take those phone calls, the patience to teach, um, all of you know how many of you ha had to teach me along the way. It matters. And now I can be an amazing advocate. And when I went back to Microsoft in June, now I can take all of that advocacy and use that power for good. We just had a big town hall meeting on campus. We brought all our team members together. Um, and we chose a charity that we were going to support that month. And I brought in an individual from the Hope and Coffee Recovery Center, had her tell her addiction story. We set up a fundraiser for, for that organization. 
And, and so it matters, and did, no matter what seat you're sitting in, you can contribute. Um, and so it's been awesome to be a part of it on both sides. And so if you could see the inside of my chest right now, it is just exploding with gratitude. It's like unicorns and rainbows and hearts and starbursts. Um, so gratitude for all of it, the coolest uh, experience. I probably wouldn't have done it for any other leader other than you. You had earned my trust along the way. And Catherine, I got to see a lot of the behind the scenes, everything. I know how hard you work at this mm. every day. Mm. And I am so proud of you. I know and um, wouldn't change it for anything. So love you both. Thank you so much. <laughs> Thank you. That's beautiful.